Hey, what brings you over? It's time for another two-minute tech tip. Hi, I'm Charlie Berger. I'm the Senior Director of Product Management at Oracle for our machine learning, AI, and cognitive analytics. Anomaly detection is a lot like finding needles in the haystacks, and it helps if you've moved the algorithms to the haystack. So today we have a library of, uh, of over 30 machine learning algorithms that are implemented as paralyzed uh, uh, in database processing algorithms. And you can use any of them in any combination, but today we're going to focus on the anomaly detection algorithms. Anomaly detection is really kind of like finding Waldo. So you know the old game, you know, you see Waldo, and you, can you find him? So let's take a look. Ready, set, go. So here's a lot of data. We're trying to find a pattern. Well, it's a two-minute tech tip, so time's up. There's Waldo. Now we're going to see if we can't show you how we do that uh, in a little bit more uh, technical detail. So we have lots of data. We have very, very few examples of fraud or anomaly detection. So we're gonna look at each and every variable and we're gonna see anything that kind of stands out as being a little bit different. And here, each one of these things may be unto it by itself sort of normal, but taken in, in combination, they're a little bit different. So let's go off and see how we can do that in uh, the product. So here we are, once again, uh, we're gonna use Oracle Data Miner. It's an add-in to SQL Developer. We have our data here. We have a bunch of data about uh, automobile insurance claims. We're going to do our old uh, visualization of that data and see if we can't see some sort of patterns here. And the idea is if it were that easy, we would have just uh, been done. But we're going to run some anomaly detection here. We're going to run a support vector machine algorithm. It's going to do automatically be looking for uh, patterns and correlations and things that really stand out. So we're going to train on normal. We're going to apply it. We're going to get our results. And voila, here are all the... Um, automobile insurance policy claims that stand out as being a little bit different. And of course, we could run this whole thing just as a nice script that automates the whole process inside the database. So here we go. So now here's our whole script. We're going to run this script, run all the processing inside the database, and voila, there are our most anomalous records. Was that a good tip? This is like a dream I've had. We want your opinion. Thanks for watching and stay tuned.